let's get started and create an SD card image for Mr. So first thing we need to do is go to the setup guide on the wiki page and we need to uh, run a script. But prior to doing the script we have a few prerequisites that need to be installed on your Mac. You need homebrew and you need git, wget, and unroar. So the first step is to install homebrew, which is fairly easy. If you go to this link included in the description below, all you need to do is copy some text and paste it into a terminal session. So here's the text. Right click and copy. Go into your terminal session and paste it in. Now, if you don't have a shortcut to a terminal session, just go to your applications folder, utility, and you'll find terminal in there. So once you uh, paste the script in, press enter, and you've installed Homebrew. Now it gets even simpler. For installing git, wget, and unroar, it says some simple commands. Brew install git. Now I've already got git and these other tools installed, so it won't install them again, but at least I can show you the steps. Now we have all the prerequisites installed. The next step is to get the SD card installer script for Mac OS X. So simply uh, copy this line. And the next step is to determine where you want to store that script. Now in my documents folder, I already have a git folder, so I will put it in there. So paste that line from the directory that you want the script to go into. After executing this command, we'll have a new directory. It's the SD installer directory, so we'll CD into it. And now we have to try and determine which disk will be our SD card. So before putting it in, putting in that SD card, do a disk utility list and it'll show you all the disks you currently have on your system. Now plug in your uh, SD card and wait a little bit and do another disk util list and you will see that there is a new disk and confirm the size, like in our case it's 31.1 gigs, confirming that that's the disk we want to use. Now run the MISC installer. Now generate the image for the SD card. Now the SD card has automatically been ejected. And voila, we're all done. You can now put your SD card into the Mr. System and get going.